With almost five and a half million people infected, South Africa has the highest number of HIV AIDS cases in the world, and over half of those are women. Sibongili contracted HIV from her husband, who refused to wear a condom despite having extramarital affairs. To use a condom, it's still a problem. They don't want to practice safe sex. It's too late for Sibongili, but now there's hope for others in the shape of this small silicon ring. South African scientists are starting clinical trials of a ring filled with antiretroviral drugs, which is inserted into a woman's vagina. The drugs are gradually released into her body over one month, warding off infection if she has sex with an HIV-positive man. The principle of pre-exposure prophylaxis, like malaria prophylaxis, is that you take the intervention prior to exposure. So people will already have the drug available in the system, even though they do not have the infection as yet. The ring needs to be replaced every 28 days to be effective, and it's too early to know whether it really works. Separate trials of a vaginal gel have so far failed, but advancements in medical technology can at least offer some encouragement to women living in a male-dominated society. For, for the gel and some other stuff that are in there, they are good because the women, they can protect themselves. Because you have to stand firm. This is your life. The ring will be in clinical trials until 2015. If it proves effective, scientists hope to have it licensed and available to women within the next five to ten years.